Hello, I am Dr. Subhash Jangir from Fortis Hospital, Gurgaon. I am the director and head of the orthopedics here. If you want to undergo a knee replacement surgery or if you are planning to undergo a knee replacement surgery, what to expect after that? There are a lot of people, they are still asking the similar basic questions that whether I would be able to walk, whether I would be able to bend the knee, whether I would be able to climb stairs. So I would like to tell you that all these activities that is normal walking, climbing stairs, cycling, swimming, you can do easily as any normal person of your age without the knee problem is able to do. That means you will be same as any other person of your age who has no knee problem would be able to walk or climb stairs, cycle or swim. Besides this, lot of people they still ask whether I would be able to sit on the floor like squatting or sitting cross-legged. So there are two types of knee replacement we do. One is the partial knee replacement, one is a total knee replacement. If your surgery has been done perfectly fine with computer navigation, so a partial knee patient will feel as good as a natural knee, which was there before the knee problem started. So they can do all the activities. They can sit on the floor, they can climb, they can do squatting, they can do all the activities except impact sports that means running or jumping all other activities they can do very easily without any problem they can do all types of yoga including surya namaskar without any problem if you have undergone a total knee replacement then i would say squatting is not that easy to do because squatting takes a lot of bending on the knee and impact on the knee joint i would say you should avoid that to increase the life of your replaced joint so in a routine case I would say if I do any replacement surgery with computer navigation, I'll give you a life of approximately 25 years. But if you abuse your joint by doing a squatting every day, then the life will be reduced by 5 to 10 years. But if you want to sit cross-legged on the bed, you can do as many times for as many hours every day, no need to worry at all. So normal walking, cycling, stair climbing, swimming and brisk walk, you can do all of them without any problem if your surgery has been done perfectly fine. Besides this, when to resume your normal activities. So if your surgery has been done perfectly fine, you can start going to your office within 7 to 10 working days, no problems at all. I would say driving will take some time, approximately 4 to 6 weeks. But if, you, if someone is there to take you to the office and bring you back to home, then you can join your office within 7 to 10 days time. Now, routine is different from person to person. Some people want to do all the activities which they were doing before the surgery. That will take approximately four to six weeks time depending upon your pre-surgery activity level. Suppose you come on a wheelchair, so I don't expect that you will be able to recover within six weeks time. You are going to take approximately two to three months time because the muscle power has gone down significantly low. If you are walking in my chamber without too much of pain and you are requiring a pain medicine three or four times in a week, you would be able to join back within one week time. 